Hello everyone, this is Evil Day. We are back again with uh, Deadhead Fred Part 3. So, I guess let's just dig right into it. I have no idea what the hell I'm, where I'm supposed to go. We came out of... Came out of that door there. And that's looking again. Fantastic. Can't walk in. Guess I'll have to break in. Alright. Do that again. Oh, alright. Snap buttons. Camera. Oh! Got it open. That big Aztec looking head, but I don't like how loud it makes everything sound. You just rush them once and then they go down. That was rather easy. Let's see what's down here. Uh, oh! oh. Alright, 
right, nothing good. Be established on that. Not back there either. That was just. <sighs> oh, okay. You opened the gate. What keen observational skills you have. Hmm. Well, if you're intending to enter the graveyard, you should know it can be a little dangerous. You see, there are zombies. Yeah, 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 yeah. Zombie shmommies. I met one of them. They're not that bad. There's also her. Her. Her who? <laughs> well, I, I love matter. the voice acting for this. She probably won't be there anyway. Foster, you said before that that you could help me. What do you mean by that? Yes, I'm a businessman, you see. I dabble in many, many things, but I specialize in dead things. And if I'm not mistaken, you're dead, right? That is what they say. That head apparatus of yours is very interesting to me. It's removable, isn't it? Yeah, it is, but I don't know much about it. No, I don't mean to brag, but I can replace it with other heads when I want. That much I do know. Watch. Fuck. Well, now that sure as shit didn't happen before. Interesting. <laughs> Got any others? Yeah, I do. See? Damn it! What the I was fuck? gonna use that! No, you weren't. It was worthless, just like that corpse head. I can smell a Steiner prototype a mile away. The doctor is quite the idea man, but his craftsmanship is, uh, shall we say, unreliable. I guess I'm stuck with the jar then. Huh. Oh, oh no, not at all. You see, I am an expert in the art of head reanimation. <laughs> I do wonderful work. Yes, yes. We can definitely work out a business arrangement, oh, you and come I. On. I can show you lots of interesting things. <laughs> You'd be surprised. You can do a lot of things with a dead head, Fred. <laughs> I suppose I'll have to take your word for it. Tell you what, I'll prove it to you. I have a few things to finish up here, so I'll be around. If you encounter zombies on your little trek through the graveyard, <laughs> and you will, remove their heads. Bring me back a few. Five should do the trick, and I'll modify one for your use. Deal? Sure. Whatever you say. Just go away. Good. <laughs> See you later. Jarhead Gator. <laughs> Be careful if you meet Jarhead Gator. her. She's not exactly right in the head. Yeah. There's a lot of that going around. Neato. Holy shit. That's enough, Tululu. Come back here. You're bothering them all. I think he's been true enough tonight, without you messing up his shoes. And just exactly what do you know about what I've been through? Oak Falls is a small place, oh, and I have that? a lot of friends here. Besides, we've met you and me, back when left to kill you. I was surprised that you came back, but that happens a lot these days. You know, you are so much more handsome now that you've passed over. Death becomes you, Detective Fred. You got me at a disadvantage here, lady. Who the hell are you? My friends call me Juju Judy. You can call me anytime. Well, maybe I'll take you up on that there, Jude. Mm. If you can give me some information. Information? What information? All the information you need is that this is yours for the taking, dead man. Mm. Pass. Now cut the shit and tell me what I want to know. Okay. This is definitely a, if uh... you want to play hard to get, 
I might have gained back then, at least. No doubt. Maybe you will use your manly strength to beat the information out of me. <laughs> that might be fun. But you will have to deal with my minions first. And now I don't have my big ass tag. Nice try, Detective Fred. Now, oh, this isn't a boss, may is the it? best dead man win. I hope not. Better than I thought. I Strong and handsome. I bet you are an amazing lover. Judy, I have to tell you something. It may turn you on. So settle yourself. If I had a mouth, I'd hurl on you. <laughs> what the hell? Oh. Judy, oh my think God, again, you suck, sexy lady. dead man. You will not get your answers from me. Not today. Au revoir, mon ami. Until we meet again. Was great. Frustrating. Terrific. Hmm. Oh. The hell is this? 
Uh, well, the so, dead pan away at this. You decided to come for a visit after all. I was beginning to think you had forgotten about me. I got a little sidetracked, and FYI, next time you tell somebody to come for a visit, you might want to provide a few more details about the crazy voodoo bitch on guard duty at the mausoleum. <laughs> so you did meet Judy. Spectacular, isn't she? I don't know. Uh, no, spectacular ain't exactly the word I'd use. What are you, to an item? You seem to be a little too alive for her tastes. Tastes have changed over the years. Lucky stiffs. <laughs> so, did you bring me the heads? Yep, I sure did. All five of them. There. Pain the that like should it was. fit nicely. Well, what do you think? Very comfy, thank you. And I'm sure I look like a million bucks wearing some corpse's head. Oh, you look fine. Honestly, it's not much worse than the brain in the jar thing. <laughs> but then again, I'm used to looking at corpses. I think they're rather lovely. I can help you with all of your interchangeable head needs. I own the Head Shop franchise. <laughs> Maybe you've heard of it? I can't say I have. Where did you get this? Boo Betty it. left it behind when she got pulled I underground by the cast know. of Night of the Living Dead. Juju Judy. Yeah, whoever. Do you know what that thing is? Of course I do. It's a mutant worm. There are mutant worms everywhere in Hope Falls these days. <laughs> they are amazing. When a mutant worm mm. burrows into dead tissue, it has interesting effects. <laughs> For example, if one were introduced to one of your heads, it would cause new and beneficial mutations, enhancing the head's powers. Head upgrades are also a specialty of mine. That gold worm there is one of the rarest and most powerful. It can permanently boost a head's performance. <laughs> You're lucky. Judy never gave me a worm. Tell this. How exactly do you use these worms? Anytime you find one, just get it to me. I can help you make the upgrade. For a small fee, of course. <laughs> of course. Thanks, pal. I'll think of you every time I find a slimy worm. Not just worms. Heads, too. I can modify heads that you collect so that you can use them. Swap them with your jar. That sounds pricey. I don't exactly have a lot of scratch at the moment. Mm, yes, that does present a problem. Wait, I've got an idea. Not a problem. We'll just do the same deal as we did tonight. I can always use new headstock, and you're bound to come across a bunch of them. <laughs> How about this? Whenever you collect five heads of any new type, Bring them to the head shop. I will keep four and modify the fifth one for you. Sound fair? Sounds like a deal. But how will I know whether you need what I've, uh, collected? Here, take this. When you collect five heads, give me a call at the head shop. The number's stored in there. Hey, don't you need this? Eh, uh, I never use up all of my minutes anyway. <laughs> company. Besides, it's got a tracking device in it. I bet Doc Steiner will want to keep an eye on where you are. <laughs> I'll let him know you have it. Oh shit! The Doc! I almost forgot about him. Pitt and his goons grabbed him. They took him someplace called Creepy Hollow. Do you know where that is? Sure. It's just beyond the graveyard. Out that way. Thanks there, Sam. And, uh, and thanks for the head, too. I'll be in touch. Alright, sweet. I think that we'll leave it at that for this one. Uh, that boss was a SOB to take down. Really quite frustrating, so... Now, I think we'll stop here for part 3. Uh, part 4 will be up on Monday, so I hope you all look forward to that. Alright, see ya!